Hello friends and welcome to virtual story time at the Chippewa River District Library. Let's sing the hello song. Hello friends. Hello friends. Hello friends. It's time to say hello. Welcome to story time. Today we are talking all about a special shape triangles. And I've got a great book to talk about triangles with you. This book is called Triangle and I bet you can see why because look what's on the cover. One, two, three. A three-sided shape called a triangle. Mm. Triangle by Matt Barnett and John Clausen. This is Triangle. This is Triangle's house. Friends, do you notice something about this house? What shape is it? Hmm. This is Triangle in his house, and that is Triangle's door. What shape is Triangle's door? Hmm. It's a triangle, isn't it? It looks like you could walk straight through it. It's the perfect shape for him. One day, Triangle walked out his door and away from his house, he was going to play a sneaky trick on Square. Ooh, I wonder what the trick will be. He walked past small triangles and medium triangles and big triangles. He walked past shapes that weren't triangles anymore. Hmm, what shapes do those look like? He walked until he got to a place where there were, oh friends, what shape is this? <gasps> Squares. Still thinking of his sneaky trick, he walked past big squares and medium squares and small squares. Hmm. Do you see the big squares? Can you find the medium squares? And where are those teeny tiny small squares? Until he got to Square's house. Now, says Triangle, I will play my sneaky trick. What do you think the sneaky trick will be? To find out, you can check this book out from the library. I'll put a link so that you can check this book out from our library in the description of this video. A triangle is a very special shape because it has three sides and three points. Let's see if we can draw a triangle in the air. Can you try drawing it with me? There you go, you made three sides. Good job, let's sing a song about it. Draw a triangle, draw a triangle. Always start at the top. Make a tent, make a tent. Use three lines and then stop. Good job. I bet you drew an amazing triangle. It's time to write. You can grab a pen and practice along with me or you can trace in the air as I write this word. All right, we'll start off with our capital letter. Tracing along. What letter is that? It's a T. Hmm, what letter do you think will come next? An R. One more. I. T R I try try. Try means three. So if you see these three letters at the beginning of a word, you know that word means three of something. Like a tricycle, which has three wheels, or a triangle, which has three sides. Friends, let's sing a song together about triangles, along with some other of our favorite shapes. Where is triangle? Where is triangle? Here I am. Here I am. 
How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away, run, run away. away. Where is Circle? Where is Circle? Here I am, here I am. How are you today, miss? Sir. Very well, I thank you. Run away, run, run away. away. Where is Square? Where is Square? Here I am. Here I am. How are you today, sir? Very well, I thank you. Run away. Run, Run away. away. Awesome. Thank you for joining me in that song. One place that we can find a triangle is when we are looking at a piece of pizza, like this piece of pizza I made here. So let's do a chant all about the pizza man who brings us our triangle-shaped pieces of pizza. I've got my pizza box with me so I can feel like a real delivery person delivering a real pizza. For this chant, we're gonna stand up. Can you stand up with me? And you can follow along as I do the motion. Pizza man, pizza man, turn around. Pizza man, pizza man, touch the ground. Did you touch all the way to the ground? Pizza man, pizza man, reach up high. Pizza man, pizza man, touch the sky. Pizza man, pizza man, touch your toes. Reach way down to your toes. Pizza man, pizza man, find your nose. Can you touch your nose? Pizza man, pizza man, find your knees. Can you touch your knees? Don't have to bend down quite as far. Pizza man, pizza man, sit down please. Great job helping me with that pizza chant. Next, I would like to do a craft with you. Would you like to do a craft? For this craft, we are going to be making our own pizza, just like in the Pizza Man song, that we can cut out a triangle from, as well as find some other shapes. If you'd like to follow along, there's just a couple of simple items you can grab from your house to make this pizza craft with me. I took this little circular part from inside of my pizza box and saved it for this craft. But if you can't find one of these, you could also just use a paper plate. Then I just used some red construction paper and I cut out little bits of string for my cheese on my pizza. And this is what the final result looks like. You can cut out a triangle from your pizza, and then you can have a triangle, and if we put it back together, a, uh, what shape is this? A circle, right? A pizza starts off as a circle, and then you cut it into triangles. All right, ready? I'll show you how I put this craft together. We start off with a four-sided square pizza box. And out of our pizza box comes our circular pizza. And then we take our triangular three-sided piece of pizza. To make our very own triangle pizza, we're gonna start with a cardboard circle. And then I've got some red construction paper I'm gonna cut out into a squiggly shape to make the sauce that goes over the pizza. So I'm just weaving back and forth not really making any specific shape, just something that would look like a splatter of sauce. There, looks like that. Now I'm just gluing that on so it sticks to our cardboard. Next we're going to need some string, and I'm just using some yellow string here. I'm folding it up so it's easy to cut, and then I'm just going to cut it into some cheese-sized little strips so you can see it looks like cheese. I'm gonna take a second to speed through and glue down each piece of cheese to my pizza. All right, we got all our cheese on there, or most of it anyway. <laughs> and now it's time to cut out our triangle out of this circle shape. So here we go, I'm just starting and cutting into the middle. This would be a good part to have some adults help to cut out your triangle and there we go I have a piece of triangular pizza while you're cutting you can keep cutting your pizza up until you have the whole pizza divided I cut my pizza into one two three four 
five, six, seven, eight equal pieces. Well, friends, I've had a wonderful time singing and dancing and reading with you, but it is time to say goodbye. Will you join me for the goodbye song? Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, friends. It's time to say goodbye. See you later.